Welcome back to Beer Geeks Beer Reviews. Tonight, I I'm, I'm just going to keep on my little uh, series, um, should I say. Uh, I'll just go ahead and get right into it, man. Tonight, we're going to go ahead and dip into, bam, Latitude 48 by Sam Adams. This is the Hopology Edition, and this is the one that has the new Hop Edition to it. And I've been kind of excited to try this one to see how it uh, bears up. It has a new uh, Mosinac, or Moisinac, uh, however you pronounce it, hop. Um, it's supposed to give it more, uh, aromatic. Let it, uh, getting a little bit of smoke out of that. We're going to put it straight up into the pine glass. Man, I, I've come across a lot of people that said that they really enjoyed this beer. Um, I myself have become a fan of it. Look at it. Nice head to it. Finish it off right there. Um, nice coloring to it. It's kind of got that traditional, you know, golden or amber beer color to it. A nice two to three finger head, you know, maybe two, two and a half, two and a quarter. Um, bubbles. Man, I, I kind of like these glasses. These glasses have seemed to give me a um, a variety of bubble style. Uh, I have had at one point in time a vortex of bubbles that was kind of unexpected. Now, this one here just seems to have sporadic bubbles, you know, carbonation bubbles around the edge of the glass. Of course, they are not uh, laser etched, so you won't get anything in the center of them. Mm, mm, mm. Anywho, enough about that. Let's go ahead and get into the nose of this. <sighs> wow, man. You can actually really smell a difference. To me, there is a difference. Uh, you can smell big grapefruits, pininess, resinous. A little bit of a bready back note to it even. It almost smells like a new beer, I'm telling you. Um, I've had the Latitude 48 for quite some time now, and uh, it's never smelled like this, man. This is, this this year, enjoyable. It actually has the same sense uh, that their, uh, their new uh, Double Agent IPL um, if you haven't had that, check it out by Sam Adams. It's actually very, very pleasing. And coming out soon in their own standalone six packs. You could only get it before in their spring thaw pack. Um, enough about that. You know, I'm just jabbering on here. Let's go ahead and get to the beer. Now, to be quite honest with you, I almost don't believe... Um, when I had this beer the last time, excuse me, um, it, it tasted more of a upfront malt character and then blended, you know, kind of, it was kind of like a combination, you know, intertwined of a, of a maltiness and a hop note. Now I'm almost guaranteeing, I'm going to tell you what, right here, this is more a hop, hop forward now. Um, I don't know what they've done. I don't know what, you know, besides the the single edition, uh, hop edition, I don't know what they've changed. Um, but it's more hoppier. This this here is hoppier than what I had before. Um, and I only had it, you know, probably about you know, three, four months ago. And it wasn't, it wasn't like this. Um, I don't know, man. This, this is pleasing. Very, very pleasing. Um... One big thing that I've liked or wanted Sam Adams to do is when they are going to do an IPA, you know, there, there are certain categories that you can go to in IPAs, you know, maltiness with hoppiness, you know, you could do hop bombs, you could do just laid back, you know, nice little, you know, palate cleansing hoppiness. Um, but they've actually started to get into more and more hoppier beers. And I'm really enjoying all of these. Um, 
Now, like I said, you know, in this review, I don't know what they've changed besides the one addition to the hop, but this is different. It is newer to me and to my palate, and I'm enjoying this very much so. I'm going to, I mean, before I was giving, you know, Latitude 48 a, a solid B plus, or even a, you know, around a B, but now, I mean, I mean, with this hop edition, Yeah, man, I'm liking it even more, man. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and say this is like, a, I'm gonna up it a bit and say that it's a good, very, very good beer, man. I'm gonna put it in an A minus and say that they they've gone a step further. Um, with that said, I'm going to go ahead and end this may make this a little bit of a shorter review tonight. Um, and say prost to all you. Um, please get your friends to subscribe, get your family to subscribe, whatever. You know, let me know what how I'm doing, man. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you guys think. Oh, excuse me, that one's for free. Um, let me know about this year's beer. Uh, I I don't know. I'm gonna have to bust out the bottle from last year. Um, I do save some bottles, and with this said, six point zero percent alcohol. Can't taste that at all. With the new hop edition, I want to know what they've done different besides just that. Uh, to me, it's like they've laid back on the malt character. Uh, but enough with me rambling on. I've rambled on too much. Uh, with that said, please subscribe, review, let me know what you think right here. Uh, I'll see you guys again next time. Pros. Cheers.